About 12 months ago, I came across a Kickstarter project from the company called Mac Agency, and they offered a product, mount your phone to a side of the monitor. As I am already a owner of the Tem1 Design Mount T and Mount T Plus, I was eager to find out how this same problem, which is mounting a phone on the side of its screen, has been resolved by a different company. So fast forward 12 months to today, finally arrived. So let's check it out how this mounting adapter performs. Is it good? Is it bad? And I'll give you my honest opinion about it. So let's begin. So here we are. This is the actual mounting adapter, which is basically, it's very simple to use. No, basically even the manual is only two steps. It's clip it and use it and that's it. So this is the mounting adapter. The, the way that this mounts on the side of your portable screen or monitor, laptop, etc., mounts on your external display is using a clamping mechanism. This opens up to 15 millimeters, so you can pretty much add this to any laptop, lab dock, screen, etc. I even can use this to mount to my ultrawide monitor like this, and it's gonna stay there. But I don't really wanna use this adapter with my for the ultrawide monitor because this clamp is being pushed to the limit. So maybe with time, I just, I, it doesn't feel safe, but it works great with my lab docks, and that's what we're gonna try. I'm gonna demonstrate for you. Besides the manual, there was a thank you card in the box, the gift card of 20% discount on their online store and the sticker which is right now attached to back on my phone which acts like a screen cleaner so you peel the sticker off you clean your phone screen and put the sticker back on but it's already after a couple of days of use gathered all the dust stuck on the on the sticky part so i'm not sure how long that's gonna last maybe warm water soapy warm water will basically get the stickiness back i will see um i'm just gonna keep using it and maybe I'll give you an update in a couple of days or a week or so. So, right, adapter. Like I said, this is opens at 15 millimeters and once it's fully closed, it's, it's a basically around 55 millimeters gap here. So obviously current smartphones definitely not gonna fit here, but this becomes quite easy to store in the bag and take it with you. And when it's fully opens, it opens up to 85 millimeters. So right now, as an example, I'm gonna take my Note 9 without the case, without the case and if I'm gonna open the latch here at the back open the latch squeeze it and then put the latch on and as you can see my phone is sits here but right now there's a problem it goes up and down so how to get this result they included two um, angles two brackets two stoppers one is left and one is right and i'll show you how they work but first let's start by demonstrating how this is getting attached to my screen or to a laptop screen First, let's go with perfect, ooh, let's go with perfect X. So if I'm gonna take this, make sure that my phone is actually sticky when I'm peeling off when I'm trying to do this. So sticker location is not that good. Let's peel that off. So if I'm gonna use this uh, mounted like that, as you can see right now, it's just like this and it's no problem. If I wanna use my phone as a, let's say front facing camera in the landscape mode or, or watching a video while my DeX is doing something, I'm doing something on a DeX, so I can turn, connect this on. Obviously I need a quite lengthy cable to get the, my phone connected to this laptop instead of using my standard, I think it's 10 or 15 centimeters length. So here we go, it's all connected. And let's say I'm watching a YouTube or something here on the screen while I'm doing the bits on my neg on my Samsung DeX. So that was great. And if I take this out, so you perfect X laptop and the stand this mounting adapter works great. Next one is the Xpand X. Which is, this is the thickest screen, portable screen I have in my position. So that's what we're gonna do. This is a 10 millimeters thickness. So if I'm gonna grab my, the phone side, phone side by the way, it's called phone side, phone side adapter, mount like this, and get those stoppers in. So the way the stoppers works, I'm just gonna show it to you quickly. There is a, like a grooves here either side so let's say if i want to mount my my phone on the left side left side of the portable screen i need to take these and i need to slide them this way so one goes this way one goes that way and now they're they're stoppers to stop my phone from dropping off so if i'm going to take this mount it on the side take my phone without the case slide it in and here we go it's in there and it's been held by this mounting adapter the, the problem would be three i thought that is a problem actually um the you put the expand x screen port, ports are facing like on the left hand side so once i connect everything how the cable is gonna go but turns out the angle that this mounting adapter is getting attached to a portable screen is and leaves a room for for connecting the cables so if i'm gonna use this 
is doesn't really bend this cable that much so that's all good i'm gonna feed the cable all around and plug it in into my note 9 and here we go i have the portable screen with the sound my note 9 attached to it and as you can see i have samsung dex running on this portable screen with no problems at all let's close all the apps and here we go attached to the back of my uh, attached to the side of the expand x so if i'm going to take this off obviously i can put this at the top if i want to like this and use it this way which is great now let's go to my most favorite lab dock which is a next dock 2 original one and why i like to use this adapter with this lab dock is the uh, bezel size if i'm gonna open this up i'm gonna connect the the um, found side to this lab dock which is works great i put my phone into the mounting adapter the mounty the mounty <laughs> the phone side mounting adapter i'm gonna grab the cables plug them in here which is works here let's grab the other end of the cable plug into my note 9 turn the next dock 2 on and here we go it's turned on it's all works great and once the dex is tied i want to show it to you that the, the clamping uh, portion of this adapter is i think it's 15 millimeters i think or it's not 15 it's 12.5 millimeters so the next dock 2 bezel is wide enough to, for the clip not to cover the some of the screen real estate so if i'm gonna open up let's say the website let's go on to the samsung dex subreddit group quickly samsung dex and what i'll show you samsung dex subreddit group reddit here we go open up the reddit the screen the, not getting covered by the clamping here so the bezels on the next dock 2 original are big uh, and they are the same width as the actual clamping mechanism but if i will try to clamp this adapter to let's say uh, next dock 2 touch it will cover some part of the screen i think it's about five millimeters of the screen will get covered by using this clamping mechanism on the next dock 2 touch and you perfect x as well because the bezels are so narrow so i have right now two different company adapters the ten one design mounty and the mckagency phone side so what i think about these two now let's say if you have the mounty already is it worth to purchase this or if you don't have any of the mounting adapters which one you would i suggest you to go and pick it up and i after using the phone side adapter for a couple of days now and been using mount adapter for quite a while now i would say that um, the mounty adapters is more when you are a lot of on the go and sometimes working on like at home in a home office mounty adapters are very useful because it's small it's easy to use and um, it all works great and for my usage when i'm working most of the time at home and once in a while i'm going on the go i'll use this because once i connect this on the side here on the side of my portable of on a portable screens it just stays here and that's how it's just gonna be mounted permanently so i'm gonna attach this i'll quickly show it to you guys so we go it's attached here and when i start my day job i just get my phone get that in here and it stays like this and i know that my phone is always lives here during my work hours and when i need to go i just grab my phone like this and just answer the calls when i've done it put back in take it out and that's it and that's it that's the phone side mounting adapter from a company called mike Agency. i think i'm pronouncing the name correctly i leave a link in description below for their kickstarter project and for their online store if you want to go and check the, this out i think i paid 25 euros or 35 euros uh the pledge cost me 25 or 35 euros and it took about a year to arrive they originally told me it's going to be um october 2020 but with everything was happening right now in the world uh and it wasn't it arrived late but it's not that super late so it just i had to wait for 11 or 12 months for this adapter to arrive and this was great so i'm just gonna back to connect this um one thing i want to show you so this is a pigeon case if i put this with this pigeon case i'll put my phone in this pigeon case actually it's, it's gonna work perfectly so if i'm gonna squeeze it and uh, here we go it fits in there with no problem but if i would use my i i blossom 360 case which has been battered quite a lot but 
this this basically keeping my phone safe um this case will fit this this mounting adapter but once i open fully opened it and extend it and i try to squeeze it is it barely fits so if your phone with the case is bigger than i think it's 85 87 millimeters this mounting adapter probably will not work with your device so thank you much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video let me know in the comment section below what you think and i'll see you in the next one goodbye